Hello my friends and welcome for my weekly whiskey review. My name is Dan and today I have an interesting episode for you to watch. I am reviewing not just one but two whiskies and I'm going to compare the Macallan 12 years old double cask and the Macallan 12 years old sherry cask. And uh, next I'm going to insert a short video where you will see the anti-forging system developed by Macallan to stop the fakers from uh, tampering with the seal. Once the bottle has been opened, it will be impossible to uh, reseal the cork as it was before. They created a system because the brand is very collectible and they want to stop fake bottles to be sold on the secondary market or on the auction sites. Recently, a bottle of uh, Macallan 60 years old was sold for nearly 1.5 million pounds. So obviously, if people are paying a fortune for a bottle, there must be something special about the way Macallan produces its scotch whiskey. Yes, I am completely aware about the average price of a Macallan bottle. It is very often overpriced because of the aggressive marketing, reputation, secondary market, and because they can and people buy it. But the reputation for a good whiskey doesn't just appear overnight. And when you build a reputation, a name, they want to keep it, to take it to the next level. And uh, the only way to do that is by providing good quality whiskey. Especially in these days when people are more and more aware about whiskey and they look for uh, quality. And I think this whiskey is not just for uh, snobs who pour Macallan over ice just because uh, the 007 agent is drinking Macallan. But it is for uh, people who can appreciate a good whiskey as well. Personally, I did not find a bad Macallan yet and I tried at least 20 different expressions in the last few years. And that's why I'm very annoyed, because many people will not have the opportunity to enjoy one, being too expensive and too um, overpriced. So, what is Macallan way of uh, producing whiskey? First of all, they have small stills for the first distillation, which allows greater interaction between the copper surface and the soon-to-be scotch. And these interactions will increase the flavor. Then they use small cuts. In the second distillation, the master distiller will, will choose uh, when to cut the product between uh, the head, heart and tail. The smallest the cut, the more pure the final scotch flavor will be. And that's because most of the impurities will be left in the head and tail. Yep, and the Macallan uses one of the smallest cut only 16% of the entire distillate. One more thing is the cask management. The uh, Macallan is probably the only distillery to uh, permanently employ a master of wood on site and they spend a huge amount of money on quality casks, having an absolute control over the flavors that enter the whiskey through maturation. In the uh, Macallan 18 years old double cask review, I mentioned how they source their wood and how they make their uh, oak barrels. Finally, the uh, Macallan does not add any coloring to the scotch. And all color in a uh, Macallan scotch is the product of maturation in various forms of oak, being 100% natural. Right, let's the battle begin. First, the Macallan 12 years old double cask, 700 ml bottle, 40% ABV, chill filtered, 
and a natural color with a blue presentation box. My Canon 12 years old double cask was released in 2016. In the same double cask range, we find Macallan Gold carrying a non age statement, and they have been uh, joined recently by a 15 years old and an 18 years old, already reviewed here. These whiskies are matured entirely in sherry cask, with the double coming from the two types of oak used American and European. The casks are seasoned with Oloroso sherry for two years in Spain before being shipped back to Macallan to be filled with new make spirit. Right. A nice light amber color in the glass, clear, beautiful natural color. On the nose. Very soft, fresh, warm and fruity nose, sweet fruits and um, sherry influence. The uh, sherry influence is not too heavy. Some um, almonds and um, a hint of um, wood shavings develop. Vanilla. No smoke, citrusy, a simple nose, no nasty alcohol, but for a 40% ABV, um, quite a decent nose. On the palate, soft cherry. Wood spices, quite thick for a 40% ABV. Caramel, apples, creamy with light uh, fruit influence. There is a sweet nuttiness too. Almonds, hazelnuts, but it's all very light. It's a good taste, but nothing to be um, excited, just an average drum. The finish is just on the sweet side, simple, medium finish with some um, orange peel. 50 pounds per 700 ml bottle make it a bit too expensive compared to other 12 years old expressions. Now uh, the uh, Macallan. 12 years old sherry oak cask. Again, 700 ml bottle, 40% ABV, chill filtered, and um, a natural color with a black presentation box. The Macallan Sherry Oak 12 years old is part of the Sherry Oak range, which features single malt whiskies matured ex exclusively in Sherry Season Oak cask from Jerez, Spain, made exclusively from uh, European oak. The color right, is burnished amber, a bit darker than the double oak version. Nice and clear and um, full body. Judging by uh, the color, there's not only um, first field sherry casks, but also uh, second field sherry casks over here. On the nose, immediately sherry, deep, syrupy, complex. Oaky, and it feels much older than uh, 12 years old. 
after uh, the first strong cherry impression you get the raisins scents of um, dry fruits marmalade and nuts rich deep beautiful smell nice balance between the uh, sherry flavors and the oak influence more uh, mature than the double oak and definitely more complex the smell is very very nice on the palate oily and very smooth rich uh, sherry flavors are here notes of caramel and more um, dry fruit if the smell if the smell was very nice the taste is nothing less dark grapes raisins dark chocolate coffee then um, a complex layer of um, oakiness and brown sugar and the slightest hint of uh, nutmeg the only uh, downside is the 40% ABV which uh, makes this whiskey um, a little thin the finish is um, silky and medium with sweet fruity notes oranges and a pleasantly bitter aftertaste of um, aged wood a typical macallan malt that should be in any well-stocked drinks cabinet and it's a shame having to pay between 60 and 70 pounds per 700 ml bottle and uh, now the verdict Macallan uh, 12 years old double cask I will give it an 8.6 out of 10 because it's a decent whiskey for an entry level drum you won't change your life but you will smell and taste decent with a good balance between the classic Macallan style and the sweetness of um, American oak. Macallan 12 years old sherry oak cask. I will give it 9.1 out of 10. Because this, in my opinion, is one of the best 12 years old whiskies on the market. It shows a complexity usually found in much older whiskies with a beautiful balance, one side with sherry flavors and the other one with oak influence. It is very pricey for uh, 12 years old, but it is, it is also an uh, exceptional whiskey for uh, this age group. This is all I have to say for today. Thank you for uh, watching. Don't forget like, share, subscribe and touch the bell and uh, I shall see you next time. Bye bye.